In this video, I'll show you how to download and install Insure on your PC. And here we are at the minute on the project editor and the timeline. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. We really do appreciate it. And without any further ado, let's go and get into this video. The first thing you need to do for this guide is to go into the video description or the pinned comment and go and tap on the link which says download Bluestacks. Or alternatively, you can go and search for Bluestacks. But now I'm going to explain what Bluestacks BlueSacks actually is. BlueSacks is an Android emulator and what this is is basically means you've got a program which is going to act as an Android device, an Android phone and you can go and use your mouse and keyboard as your fingers um, and you can go and use mobile apps on it. Now what I recommend doing is downloading BlueStacks 5 so all you need to do is press on download BlueStacks 5 just on the home page just like so and here we are. When you go and first download it, it's a very small um, download because this is just the installer and then in a moment we'll actually go and download BlueStacks. Now every browser is slightly different, so your downloads may not appear in the bottom left. So you may need to go and open so you may need to go and open up the file explorer and go to your downloads folder. So once you found the BlueStacks installer, all you need to do is go and double tap on it, just like so, and then you're going to go and get a Windows security pop-up and you need to go and agree. So all you want to do is go and click on install now and it's gonna go and start the download process. And here we are, it's almost finished installing, so I'm just gonna to continue to wait. And then once you've finished installing it, you're going to get this screen here, and it's gonna have a message saying starting BlueStack. So all you need to do is sit back and wait for it to start. And then once BlueStack is loaded, you need to go and open up the Play Store to go and tap on Play Store on the home screen, just like so. And here we are, it's now loading. And the first time you open the Play Store, you will need to go and sign into a Google account. Um, that's a really simple process. And then once you've signed in, you can then go and search for apps. Just go and tap on search for apps and games and then we can go and search for InShot. And here we are, here is InShot right at the top. So you can go and tap on it just like so. And then you can go and press install and then it's gonna go and start downloading it. And InShot is now finished downloading and installing and it does everything by itself. And then all we need to do is go and press on open just like so, and then InShot is gonna go and launch. So here we are in InShot, but before we go any further, we need to go and add some videos to BlueStacks, which you want to go and edit. So what you want to do is go and press on the home button, either in the top or in the bottom right. Um, so let's go and press on it, just like so. And then what you need to do is go and press on system apps, and then in system apps, you need to go and click on media manager, just like so. And this is gonna go and launch our sort of file explorer. And what we need to do is go and import some clips from Windows, which you want to go and use in BlueStacks. And you need to come to this same screen once we exported the video from InShot to then go and export it to Windows from BlueStacks. So I've now imported a video, so let's go back and go and open up InShot and go and edit it. So on InShot, all you need to do is press on video, just like so, and then you need to go and press allow, um, and then we can go and access the video we just imported. So I've got this one here, so I'm gonna go and tap on it, and then I'm gonna go and press on the green tick, just like so, and it's now processing. And then you'll be taken to the editor, and it's gonna go and give you a few instructions of how you can go and use things. So go and press next, and just go and read it, and then we can go and get editing. So we can go and scrub through the track just like so, click on it and then we can go and start making splits and crops and loads of other things and that's literally it. If you found this video useful on how you can get InShot, please go down below and leave a like, subscribe for more, peace.